Meet Jane. Jane runs a small online store where she sells her doggy art. But she has a problem, her website is super slow and it's making her lose customers. But Jane has found a solution, Cloudways! Alright, so I guess you have met our store owner Jane who sells her doggy art on her website that is pretty slow. Okay, so what would you recommend to a client like this? I think Cloudways could be a solution for store owners especially who have high trafficked websites, e-commerce websites. I don't necessarily believe that it's for everyone. I think it could be an overkill, but if you are an established business and let's say you are starting to, your business is starting to pick up, your store is doing very well, or your blog or any kind of website that you have that gets a lot of traffic, what you need is speed performance, reliability, security, and so on. So let's cover these core features and see how Cloudways can help you. Cloudways does things differently. They manage the hosting. So that means they take care of all the tricky parts of your website. So basically you don't have to deal with anything like that. So let's get deeper into that. First, let's talk a little bit about speed. We all know that how important speed is for websites these days and performance as well, of course. And this is one of the core features of Cloudways. They use SSD drives. And if you don't know what an SSD drive, I mean, I'm sure you know, but an SSD drive is something that you store important information on. In this case, Cloudways stores all your website stuff on their SSDs. And this makes your website perform so much faster be faster in general and they also have built-in tools like varnish like memcached and redis varnish and memcached are caching tools and if you don't know what caching is example varnish stores or caches a copy of your website so next time when someone visits your website varnish serves them a copy of your website that making your website load faster i think that's all we want and everyone wants this these days. We are on such a quick, quick, quick vibe. And memcached is pretty interesting. Honestly, I have, I did not know what these things do. I had to Google myself. So memcache stores frequently requested data in memory, like the RAM, so it can be retrieved super fast. So it's great for speeding up data queries by keeping popular information ready to use. So when someone requests information that is dynamic on your website this is sped up it's given to them super fast they don't have to wait so again this makes your website load so so much faster anyway i will have resources to this information as well in the description below so you can read further um, I think it's interesting. I'm not necessarily into this techie stuff, but it's important to know what you are getting for your money. Okay, let's talk about security because this is also a very, 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 very important part about maintaining a website's health, right? And having your website not be attacked. So Cloudways does something called managed security, which means that they keep your website always up to date, have strong firewalls to block these attacks. Also, they give SSL certificates so for free. So this is something that is very important. You should not have a website without SSL certificate because it makes it less secure. People will not trust your website. You need an SSL certificate and why not get one for free, right? And if you have problems, they are there for you 24 seven. They are like your tech team ready to help you. Let me know if you have ever used Cloudways and if their tech support is stellar or if not what issues you've had with them i'm sure they will want to know where they can improve all right so let's talk a little bit about cost because sometimes we are more interested in, in finding out how much a product or service costs before we look into all the benefits that you get from it right so this do something very interesting is a cold pay as you go so you only pay or only for usage they practically have no fee hidden fees so you know how to manage your budget let me know again if you have, have ever had any issues with this if you ever use cloudways all right so let's see cloudways in motion in action let's see what we can do with it and how easy it is to use because somehow i have the impression or i had the impression before that is quite difficult to use it's very techy and i'm more of a designer than tech person <laughs> tech geek but 
yeah let's see how easy you could use it if you are the client yourself all right so i'm in my backend in cloudways and this is what i see so now i have to choose to deploy an application an application is basically in my case wordpress so i am just going to name my application this is just whatever you want it to be so i'm gonna say project chain and i'm gonna copy and paste this it doesn't have to be the same can be anything and now we have access to the servers that we can select in order to start in order to build our application on all right and now we have access to all these servers so DigitalOcean, Vulture, Linode, Amazon, and Google are servers. So now we need to set up a server in order for our application to work, right? To build our application on, on it. And you can choose any of this. So you can see the pricing. I just click on them. You can see what you get for, let's say, let's go to DigitalOcean first. And for two gigabyte server size, we get you can see the difference in pricing here. So you choose this depending on what kind of website you have, uh, what kind of server you need for your website, etc. So this is something that you need to decide yourself. And you can hover over the eyes here and you can get more information on the servers themselves. And you have a more informed opinion this way. All right now you can choose the server size as i said depending on your website uh, size i think a two gigabyte should be okay for a standard website but again this is a decision that you have to make but you can always downgrade or upgrade just by sliding this slider over it's so simple all right so now depending on where you are in the world uh, you can choose your server location so for example i'm in germany so i'm gonna go with frankfurt there's nothing else in germany but frankfurt if you're in the uk you can choose london or india bangalore and uh, you get it right and so on and so forth all right so i think we are ready to launch our application and this is the price that you pay monthly and it's a pay as you go let's click on this and for now we don't want to do this and it's going to be taking seven minutes for this server to be created this server is created according to our needs and according to our settings the settings that we have set in the previous step so this is unique to us all right so as you can see uh there are some steps here that are outlined uh showing you how you can take your website live with cloudways basically just three steps super simple steps all right i will revert, revert after five minutes and uh, we continue all right so our server is ready as you can see here is called project jane it's created and was created on this date this is the size of the server ip and location and let's see a little bit let's go down the page and see what else we have here yes this is everything that i have said in uh, my earlier intro um something to know that i actually very happy when this happens <laughs> for example when there's human support because nowadays there's barely any human support on any uh, SaaS product or anything that we are using. So in my eyes, this is a very plus plus. All right. So, okay, let's go to uh, our application. Let's see if I click here, project chain. All right. Okay. So now we have access to everything and it's quite overwhelming the one thing that we need to basically do right now is go to our admin panel so as you can see this is our website let me just let me just open this and see we are this is familiar right this is the only thing familiar so far all right so now we have to add our credentials in and i'm gonna copy this because 
these are my credentials and then this as well so just so you know i am doing this for the first time because i wanted this to be as um let's say to be as authentic as possible to see how easy or difficult it is to use cloudways as a hosting all right and now this is even more familiar right i just want to get rid of that so we don't want that we don't want that we don't want that at a glance no all right so i'm gonna leave all those on so this is the back end of your dashboard so we have wordpress installed now all we need to do is just install our usual plugins that we use on website so if i go to plugins you can also see what plugins it comes with usually this i just deactivate oh why delete all right so you can or we could look at the uh, at this plugins another time if you want in a different dedicated video so yeah pretty much that's it let me just add a plugin and see guess what plugin i'm adding that is elementor and um why is this i see all right so i'm gonna install it and just adding elementor free to see how the website performs with okay so i'm gonna create my account and i'll be back all right so now i'm continuing i'm doing all the steps that i need to do i am gonna skip everything and added a blank page of Elementor. All right, get out of here. I'm just going to publish and now we can test it to see how it performs. All right, so now I'm going to add it here uh, to test the speed of it. I only have installed Elementor and that's it. I have nothing on the page and I will test it with a few elements on the page as well. So let me just add it in here let's analyze this is the first step okay so we are checking the mobile first all right this is not bad okay seo wise it's okay we didn't do anything seo <laughs> oh my god this is actually fantastic okay let's see if we add a few things on the website how the website performs so usually we have a container let's also add a heading let's also oops let's add an image and select a file we probably have nothing i'm going to go with this uh this is a png it's okay uh this will impact the speed let's be real uh, but again it's fine select so we have an image what else usually we have on websites okay i can add some text underneath i can also let's add a video you never know uh, let's update and now let's test again the website <laughs> okay keep in mind that the website has not optimized has not been optimized for mobile in terms of responsiveness so that might be impacting the per the the score here so we're doing very well considering the fact that we have a png uh, a png that has not been optimized for web so i think this is pretty cool um yeah disregard this because again i have not optimized uh, anything else on the website but just as a plain example I think it's pretty impressive all right so let me know in the comments below if you are using cloudways if you have used cloudways let me know what do you want me to cover further in future videos and also i will have listed in the description below all the resources them that you might need to look deeper into cloudways so see you next time